You're not using voltage drop to find electrical problems? Stay tuned, let me show you guys real quick how to use a voltmeter to check for voltage drop on the power and ground side of any electrical circuit. Let's take a look. As always, the first thing we're gonna check is gonna be our power and ground for our electrical circuit. And we got 12.59 volts, meaning we have a good electrical circuit and we're ready to test. Now, anytime we're gonna test for voltage drop, the circuit needs to be on. The one thing you always want to remember when you're doing a voltage drop test is positive to positive or negative to negative. I'm leaving my positive lead here and I'm gonna move my other lead to the positive side of my actual load. Across my load, or on the power side to my load, we're losing 128 millivolts, indicating there's a small amount of resistance from the positive side of the battery all the way to the positive side of my electrical load. And that's it, guys. Voltage drop testing is super simple. If you wanna learn more, check out my full YouTube video so this way you guys can learn how to set up and how to run certain voltage drop tests. See you guys on the next one.